Together, let us pray the third novena to Saint Martin of Tours. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Opening prayer. Father, by his life and death, Martin of Tours offered you worship and praise. Renew in your hearts the power of your love so that neither death nor life may separate us from you. Grant this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. The Third Day Dear Lord, we thank you for giving us St. Martin of Tours as an example of holiness. Help us to imitate the love of you he showed in his charity towards the poor beggar he encountered. St. Martin of Tours, you encountered a poor beggar during your early years as a soldier. Moved with pity for the man, you gave him half of your cloak out of love for God. Please bring my petitions before God whom you loved. In a dream that night, Jesus appeared to you as the beggar. You saw that your act of charity had pleased God greatly. Pray for me that I may always be conscious of the needs of the less fortunate around me. Pray that I may be eager to assist my brothers and sisters in Christ out of love for God. St. Martin of Tours, pray for us. Novena Prayer to St. Martin of Tours Blessed St. Martin of Tours, full of the Spirit of the Lord, always having inexhaustible charity, for the needy. You, who full of love and generosity, when you saw the beggar that was freezing from cold, without knowing that in truth he was Christ, did not doubt to give him half of your cape, and did not give it completely to him, since the other half belonged to the Roman army. You, who did not seek recognition, but only to favor your neighbor, found glory before the Lord. And when the Savior appeared to you, dressed with half cape, so as to express appreciation for your gesture, and he told you, Today you covered me with your mantle, you decided to no longer serve the army, and to dedicate your life to God and to the salvation of souls, being from then on a propagator of faith and a holy man totally dedicated to whomever was in need. Glorious Saint Martin, you who worked miracles and prodigies, who with joy, amiability, and the most exquisite goodness won over the hearts of all and did not cease to ever work for their well-being. Give me your hand and help me to come out of all lack and scarcity which today afflicts me and weighs me down. Glorious Saint Martin, my blessed patron, I humbly ask you with great faith that you attain from God the fount of all mercies, that my ways on this earth, my work and my toils be cleansed and opened with clarity. In the name of omnipotent God, Saint Martin of Tours, remove all that harms me and give me work and prosperity. O blessed relief, give me your saintly protection, 
assist me i beg you in these difficult times kindly mention your request here our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil amen hail mary full of grace the lord is with you blessed are you amongst women and blessed is the fruit of your womb jesus holy mary mother of god pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death amen concluding prayer you noble saint martin who have miraculous power take my supplications with haste to the heavens ask for my home all that is good may sorrows ruins and miseries leave and may the lord deign i merit blessed fortune in my work and with it abundance and prosperity so i may give freely to all in need saint martin blessed bishop of tours may your virtues and charity accompany me always i will not cease to pray to you and to thank almighty god for all the favors granted and i promise to be charitable and giving with all my brothers and sisters in need saint martin please intercede for me free and protect all my loved ones and i from all that is evil amen glory be to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit as it was in the beginning is now and ever shall be world without end amen